Maddox breaking all time highs. This video is everything about Polygon. There are so many opportunities on this blockchain. You don't want to miss out. I'm going to show you guys how to add it to your MetaMask, how to swap tokens, how to leverage your assets on this blockchain. And at the end, we're going to chart up Matic and we're going to do a price prediction to see where it may end up going. Let's get right into this. checking out the channel every day we put out a new video about cryptocurrency education markets giveaways and more make sure you hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss out on any content now let's go to the moon so Polygon, Ethereum's Internet of Blockchains. Polygon is a protocol and a framework for building and connecting Ethereum's compatible blockchain networks, aggregating scalable solutions on Ethereum, supporting a multi-chain Ethereum ecosystem. Its native currency, Matic, is breaking all-time highs right now. We're going to keep the charting to the end of the video, so let's get right into it. We're going to first add the uh, network to our MetaMask. So if you just search Polygon, you'll see the mainnet right here. We connect our wallet. We've already added this network to our MetaMask, but you can do, do so here by searching that and then adding the Polygon network. It's very easy. If you still don't have a MetaMask, in the comment section, I posted a MetaMask tutorial, uh, which we went over everything. So you should be able uh, to figure that out and you should be able to move forward from here. So the next step is after uh, adding your MetaMask network, we can go to Uniswap. So Uniswap, you can see right here our MetaMask. We also have some Matic ready. You can see that um, we have 1,029 Matic. If you don't have any assets, you can go to Binance, uh, any centralized exchange and buy them. And then you can send them over to you uh, to your address to your wallet. So let's get started. We're going to start with the basic swap. So Uniswap allows you to trade on different networks from Ethereum uh, to Optimism and Arbitrum. But the more popular um, you know, swap on Polygon is QuickSwap. It's very popular. I mean, uh, Uniswap's slaying in terms of uh, market cap and like users and volume in terms of like DEXs, but let's just do some quick swaps on both networks. We're going to do, um, let's just do 10 Matic on each network. That's not a coin. Oops, let's go into USDT because I have a little bit here. So let's do 10 Matic into USDT. We're going to swap that. And it's supposed to be a lot cheaper. So you can see how cheap this is. This is like cents and very quickly, a lot quicker than Ethereum and a lot cheaper than Ethereum. So you can see um, how quick that'll finish up. And that costed me cents. It's pretty much free. Let's go into Uniswap. So this is quick swap um, dot exchange and this is app.uniswap.org. Let's do another swap into USDT. We're going to do 10 Matic. Same thing because we're going to end up going and finding protocols to leverage um, some of this, some of our coins. We're going to stake some Matic and maybe some USDT as well. So I'm going to show you guys where to find these coins. The first place could be coingecko.com. You could go into categories right here, and then we can look into smart uh, contracts. Um, let me go here, coins, categories, and then you can go into smart contract platforms right here. And then we actually saw Polygon ecosystem. So the Polygon ecosystem is what, you, and you can see over the seven days, it's up 56%. Um, and you can kind of look for Polygon tokens, tokens that are on the Polygon network, because a lot of these tokens are cross chain, so they're on multiple networks. But you can see over the last seven day trend, a lot of these coins have done extremely well. Um, and, and then probably you're just going to keep moving up with the bull market. So this is a place to look on CoinGecko. This is also another awesome place, DeFi Llama. You can go to chains right here and then we're going to go to Polygon. So this is finding protocols, um, that we can leverage our assets, that we can leverage our tokens on the Polygon, on the Matic, yeah, on the Polygon network, like our Matic tokens, like our USDT and any token that will, um, that, that we're able to stake or farm. So the number one uh, protocol is Aave and it is pretty much 
It's number one on Ethereum, I, uh, I believe so as well. They have $28 billion locked up. You can see that they offer it for the Polygon network, Avalanche as well, and then Ethereum. So let's go and move forward with this. We're going to start with this one. This is probably like the most blue chip, the largest, you know, um, dap there is for loaning and borrowing. So you're not going to get the best rates. But... Um, I really trust the the uh, Aave protocol, so it's not bad to you know leverage your currencies here. You can borrow against your Matic, so if you didn't want to sell it, let's say you had a million dollars in Matic, you can borrow against it, and you can take out USDC, DAI, USDT, and then actually return the loan and then take back your Matic. So you don't have to sell cryptocurrency anymore. Also, if you had any of these other currencies on the Matic network, you could leverage them as well too. The returns aren't the greatest here because this is a very well you know established uh protocol and they have a ton of funds already allocated so it's more safe you'll i don't think you'll lose any funds on ave it's hard to say because it's still all fairly new and you know hacks are happening every day um but ave has been around for a long time let's go into more um more protocols to actually make a stake. Let's take some of our Matic. So let's go back to DeFi Lama right here and let's pick something that is more low key. So Beefy Finance, number seven. Seven is my favorite number. Let's go to Beefy Finance. Let's go to the website. And this is all on the Polygon network. So you can see here Polygon app. Let's go. And then you can see. Uh, total value locked $128 million. Let's do single assets. Awesome, it's already there. And let's look for Matic. So there is uh, $2.7 million locked up. And you can see I'm earning a 0.008.5% daily um, APY. And that's compounded. So about 3.4%, 3.14% a year. Nothing crazy. It's pretty safe. And we're going to do this um, because it's so cheap. I'm just going to do nine of them. So let's do nine unless there's a minimum. No, there shouldn't be a minimum. So, And this is the beauty with these protocols. No KYC. It's permissionless. It's trustless. Anybody can access it with Wi-Fi. You know, nobody can get denied. All you need is proof of funds. You need to have the funds in your wallet. And then you can access this. You could borrow funds. Nobody will deny you because of your race, of your background, because of, you know, your financial status. Um, it's, it's crazy where this, where DeFi is headed. So we have just um, allowed this protocol to use our Matic. And now we are going to deposit nine matic and now uh we are staking nine matic on the beefy.finance app and i'm earning 3.14 percent so you can see here right now i have 25 dollars deposited and i'm going to be earning this apy over here this is the daily apy so very easy very quick very cheap and then should we go on uh, check out more protocols why not let's go back to DeFi llama and this is a bridge so this is actually perfect because we can use a bridge right now and then i can show you how to bridge your assets and i have a video on bridging and you can check that out but i can just go over it quickly right now to bridge there's two ways you can use a centralized exchange like sending it to binance or ftx and then withdrawing to any chain that you want or you can use a bridge like this so you can see that i'm on the matic network right here uh the the polygon network and matic is my coin you can see that i have usdt right here if i want to move that over to the binance smart chain i can do so um easily by just bridging the tokens like this and it'll come to the same metamask wallet unless i choose to send it to a different wallet but you can see it's very easy to do so uh, this is any swap dot exchange it's actually rebranded to multi swap multi chain dot org right now so this is a way to bridge your tokens from any network not just matic from any network any token pretty much any any um you know stable coin or native currency on that blockchain you can move it to any network or send it to an exchange very easily the next thing we're going to go into is the price and this is important we are creating this is beautiful right here actually we are making higher highs 
higher lows, higher high, higher lows. When you see a higher high, you want it to invalidate the prior high. And not only did it do that, it kind of bounced off of it right here as support. And now we're going into the all time high. Maddox breaking all time highs right now. It did break its all time high slightly. So now let's take a look at where it could go. Um, this is on the weekly right now. I want to just measure one thing. How much of these, uh, how far do these pull back every time? And I'm going to use Fibonacci to see that. So I can see that it pulled back more than the 61.8, but it did bounce right there. So that's 61.8 right there. Um, let's see how far it pulled back from this point to here. 61.8 pretty much. Let's see if I got that. I need to adjust that. Almost the 61.8. So after it moves, it pulls back a pretty decent amount. And why I'm looking at that is because I'm kind of expecting the price to pull back after it gets rejected from resist from all time high in the resistance here. And we just measured these two prior moves and we're seeing a similar type of 61.8% point, uh, uh, type of pullback. So if we did get a pullback, this would actually line perfectly with the uh, prior swing high and let me just get my highlighter out. The, it would actually line up with the prior swing high pretty nicely right here. I screwed that up. And you know, it's looking very bullish right here, so it might not go down that low, but if it does, and this is an awesome trend line that's holding. It could wick down here. That would be a nice entry in the $2 mark. And if it holds that $2 support, if it does come down there, this would kind of be my next target as it looks like it's just kind of blowing through resistances at the $4 mark. And if it just keeps going through, I'm looking at Matic to hit $5. Maybe if it, we get just rejected under the $5 mark, and uh, you know we're at a pretty important area right here. We're looking for it to break its all-time high, looking like a small rejection. If I go on the daily or even the four-hour, you can see some sort of uh, just rejection here. Maybe we can fall back into the moving average and then work our way back into the all-time high. You know, it's it's not normal not breaking it the first try and kind of pulling back here. We're gonna you know accumulate. Everybody's gonna reposition and then it's gonna blast off. So I hope you guys got some value from this, learned how to use uh, the Polygon network. If you have any questions, post them below and I'll see you guys tomorrow.